growing up, I didn't have a real relationship with my hair. It was just like a base to other type of hairstyle. In public school here, you have to women have to shave their heads because they believe that if a woman just let her hair grow, she will seduce people. That's crazy. That's just crazy. They also believe that a woman that is too interested in beauty with long hair, she's not gonna focus on their study. I had to shave my hair. And that's when I realized I was really loving those <laughs> my hair. I tried to find, how oh, can I make my hair grow again? And I was completely desperate. And I found out on YouTube the video of Black American women letting their hair grow. And I was completely amazed. It was the first time of my life I was seeing Black women with the natural hair. Going back to natural hair, it made me appreciate over time, over things about myself that made me Black. I found on Facebook uh, a photo album of the type of hairstyle women were wearing prior to colonization. I was just amazed by it. And it really made me want to start experiment with my hair, with my own braids. Women, especially black women from America, they were start to send me messages saying that seeing my picture was helping them to love themselves a little more. And I was shocked because I was doing it for fun, just for the beauty, just for the aesthetic. And yet some women say that what I'm doing just helped them. My daily life was filled with um, sexism and patriarchal behavior. So before even like starting doing hard, feminism was something very important for me. So it was very natural and obvious for me that once I realized that my heart has power and that I need to associate the two. The whole society I live in is my inspiration. There is no specific way to reach a point where you will love yourself, but just trust the process, take it easy, and every, every day just try to surround yourself with loving people that support you and everything will follow.